do subscribe to ikeda channel and press bell icon to get updates about latest engineering hsc and iit je main and advanced videos hello students today we are studying chapter human reproduction and in that we are studying topic structure of ovum now ovum is the female gametophyte which is haploid so let's study about its structure today Ovum being the female gametophyte is haploid but it's non-motile and it when fuses with sperm it leads to the process of fertilization and finally a zygote or a new progeny or a offspring is formed. So ovum is also termed as female gamete or simply you say it egg. It is unicellular, it's non-motile, cannot move and haploid which it means has 23 chromosomes. It's covered by a layer of zona pellicida. Now this layer thickens and prevents the entry of other sperms which were released after fertilization has been done. So once a particular sperm and a particular ovum has fertilized, the one that is fastest and reaches fastest, the rest of the sperms are eventually killed. Zona pellicida is secreted by the ovum itself. Students, in this diagram, you all can see the structure of ovum, which has the nucleus with it and consisting of the cylindrical polar bodies. There are two membranes present. The inner membrane is the Wittlein membrane. Inside that, there is a granular cytoplasm present. And this is the zona pedosuda region, which actually makes sure that the formation of ovum and the fertilization process is in proper order. So students, in this part of the chapter, we came across the structure of ovum. I hope students, you all are very clear with this concept. Thank you.